Hey YouTubers. Okay, so I never really had a Reborn doll and so I decided to buy one off of Wish and you know, I thought I loved the outfit that she was in. This outfit has like little monkeys all over it. But when I got her, she was wrapped in a bag. Downfall. But she also had a button broken, so I've got to fix this before I can give her actually to my daughter. That's what I'm going to do with her. I'm going to give her to my daughter. Oop, showed her face, but okay. Anyhow, um, no proper box opening, but if you ever seen the dolls on Wish, for about $100, you can get a fairly good doll. They are lightweight. There's no, there's no weighting in them. They're super, to me, overstuffed. Um, she did come in a diaper, and it's this really cool Japanese-looking diaper. Um, she has a passy. Um, different, I want to say dexterity, but that's right. All right. But her hair, she has this net over her hair. She's a really pretty doll um, for a first-time reborn collector. My daughter's 11. So this is the doll she's getting for Christmas. She has a cloth body. Uh, full arms. Well, I guess. No, because they have fabric down here. Wait a second. Let me pause and I will undress her real quick. Okay, so I took her, her clothing off. She's got the, I guess, three-fourths arms on her. She's really squishy. I can't, I think she has some stuff inside of her, but she does not have anything to make her weighted. So she's just really soft. Um, they actually did some detailing on her. She does have blushing uh, in different places, but you can, you know, it just looks kind of weird to me. She has a pink spot right there. And I'm like, okay, so that's a pink spot. Her blushing on her hands, and she's got her nails done. Her lip color's pretty. Um, she's kind of got part lips. But let me go ahead and take this off really quick. Because I've already looked at her a little bit. Um, she has a hair bow on. And it's not micro-rooted. It's like choppy rooted to me. Hair's soft, but definitely tell it's for a doll. Her eyelashes, she looks really pretty. So for a first time doll, for an 11 year old, this is what I'm getting for my 11 year old. Um, for about a hundred bucks, it's worth it. I mean, if you're afraid that she might tear it up or anything like that, but I mean, it's, it's got, you know, all the protection parts where the they put the doll together is got covers on it. So, you know, and she's really cute. So she will wear probably newborn to like zero three months. Um, she is way bigger than the doll that I got my other daughter, but I will do a video on that one. I actually purchased her off of eBay for my other daughter for Christmas because they are now, I'm just weird I, I'm just keep playing with this doll <laughs> but uh, I think that says chicolas as I, was, I don't know anyhow but that's what she looks like there's she's just a basic beginner doll and that's what I wanted to get my daughter um so if you're wanting to buy your seven-year-old one Wish they're a hundred dollars. I think I paid 10 15 bucks for shipping. It came in a bag, um, so yeah. But this is what you'll get if you get one of her. She's wearing the monkey suit, I call her the monkey baby. But yeah, this is what she looks like. Um, she's she's okay. I mean, I've seen people say the Ashton Drake dolls are about the same, so um. I hope my daughter enjoys her because she's she's really cute. I mean, she's a lot bigger and she's not weighted, but I can change that. I will probably end up taking some of her stuffing out and putting putting a little bit of stuff, something in there to make her a little heavier because she is super, super light. But 
Okie dokie. First time doll. Bought it off a of wish. So, I will do a box opening. Oh, well, yeah. Box opening on my daughter's doll because I got her in the mail and I want to make sure that it's what I got. So, alright. Thanks for watching. Give me a thumbs up. Keep, keep watching. Bye.